What's going on guys? It's your boy DPJ here today with another Destiny video and today I bring you Zer's location and loot for the 30th of September 2016. Now he's located in the tower in what I call the Disco Room. Let's pop a few moves, you know what I mean? Woo, booty! Okay, so he's in the far corner as he always is when he's down here, we all know this. Okay, so let's see what he has. Damn that music slide. <laughs> um, okay, so we've got a boot or leg armor legacy engram. Again, guys, don't get this twisted. You will only get that year one leg armor from this, which is pretty pointless. Why would anyone want to buy year one legacy engrams to get leg armor? That don't make sense to me, but yeah, whatever. Uh, if you want them people that are missing a year one leg armor, uh, this is the way of getting it. Okay, for the Titan, we have the Armamentorium chest armor dropping out at 350 defense, offering 129 discipline. With this, you gain an additional grenade charge. This will cost you 13 strange coins. Um, next up for the hunter, we have the sealed Ahamkara grasps. These again costing 13 strange coins, and again, as always, offering 350 defense, offering 53 intellect and 53 strength. Gain an additional melee charge, and melee damage may reload primary weapons. Uh, not bad to be honest, but I guess not I must own. I mean, like, I've never used, I've had these for, for a long, long time. I don't think I've ever used them once, but yeah. Uh, one for the collection, if you're one of these people who like to collect all exotics. For the Warlock, we have the Void Bank Vestments. This is a chest armor. 13 strange coins, 350 defense, offering 81 discipline and 85 strength. Not bad at all. Spawn with full grenade and Axiom Bolts gains an additional seeker. Ridiculous. Axiom Bolts always one shot me. And when I've got an extra seeker, then I'll fuck your ass up. Again, like I said, 13 strange coins. Weapon of the week, we've got the Mila multi tool. One of the best PvP weapons in the entire game. And must buy for anybody who does not have it. And you've got the spare strange coins 100% on that one. Okay, so ornaments we have. The Iconic Class, this is a ornament for the Infective. Which I can actually show you guys. I don't know if I've got my Infective on me. But I will grab it at my vault. Just give me a quick second while I bring my gear manager up on my PC. Right in Infective. And there, is that the one I've got it under? I'm not even sure. Let's just see. Um, yeah, it is. There it is. The Iconoclast. Um, not as good as this one. I wish it was this one, but then again, I still don't have. The, I don't have the silver dust to purchase them because they cost a shit ton of silver dust from the. I mean, 25. I think it is scandalous. That is 25 silver dust. Absolutely ridiculous. Okay, we got the Heart of Gold ornament for the truth. Now this is absolutely sexy looking. We all seen that golden truth. That is what this bad boy is. Um, actually, another quick reminder, guys. If you've got the strange coins spare, be sure to buy heavy ammo simps if you want to rank up. A hundred strange coins on these heavy ammo simps will get you three ranks with a faction, and that is a great, great way of leveling up. Faction gear drops great, great loot, which is 99% of the time at a higher light than the current gear you're wearing. But yes, guys, that's what Zer's brought on the 30th of September 2015. If you guys enjoyed the video, do hit that like button. I do appreciate the support. Subscribe for Daily Destiny. Turn on the notifications so you don't miss a thing. And I'll catch you guys on that next one. Always in the wrong. Get it right.